So what do you got for me? Oh man, let's get right into this. All right. Uh, coming from uh, Google Plus, this is Marcos D831. <laughs> Marcos D8, that's his code name. That's apparently. his code name. You All know. Right, but so, uh, what do you think of computer generated art? Examples genetic algorithm based images, music, etc. Yeah, I, I, I'm cool with it. Yeah? I, really, really. In fact, when it first came out, it was striking, you know, because it was different and it had a different kind of sound. But personally, mm -hmm. I think that. The computer doesn't yet know how to feel emotion. Yes. And what is art without, without emotion? emotion? That's my line. May I say that cleanly, please? I'm sorry. What is art without emotion? Okay, now you can butt in. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so, so I mean, think about it. You know, I love me some some um, Escher, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. uh, the first MC. <laughs> M.C. Escher. M.C. Escher? Yeah. I don't even think I'm familiar with M.C. Escher. <laughs> you didn't hear him at the club the other night? Yeah. <laughs> so, so the artist M.C. Escher, his drawings are like perfect illustrations of geometric forms, basically. Okay. And so they're fun to look at, they're fun to get lost in, but at the end of the day, you don't take emotional ownership of it. Right. And I think the greatest art allows you to walk up to it and say, that means something to me, regardless of what the artist thought or felt. Mm -hmm. And then it's a communion between you and the creative energies of the artist. If it's a computer just punching out notes right. according to some algorithm, I, I don't know that it can reach those same heights. But now, when... So, so maybe we need a computer that like, can cop an attitude. That's what I was <laughs> And then it, it, it composes music while it's under a disturbed mental states. You need a computer that can have a broken heart. That's <laughs> a, you need a computer to get dumped by a girl. A computer that, uh, that means a computer's a guy. Excuse me, don't you know that all computers that announce the end of the world are female? Well, wouldn't they though? <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> there, there is two minutes left before it's self-destruction. That's true. Yeah. It's not like, yo, get the hell out of there. And see, that's why they don't make it a man's voice, because they would actually add some urgency to it. You know what I mean? <laughs> Self-destruct in 10 seconds. Right. Yeah, the world will end. What they should have is a brother, a real brother, just like, yo, man, you're going to die. <laughs> man, get the hell out of here. What's your problem? Are you crazy? You still here? <laughs> that'll that'll work. That'll be good. That'll be the the, the brother computer. The right? brother computer. <laughs> oh damn, man, you did. Okay. So I think for if a computer were to compose the blues, it would need to know sadness. Right. And I sim I, I just don't know how that. Maybe that day will come. You can program that in. But right now, no. So yes, I I I'm happy to call it art. But it's not the highest levels of art that members of our own species have achieved. So computers can make art. It's just art that sucks. Yeah. Okay. Exactly. I'll, I'll accept that. I'll accept that. All right. Well, <laughs> okay. Yeah. Let's move on. Oh, by the way.